So here is the Rode mic on my camera that I did the other test on. And um, if you see here is the on and off switch. I don't have the high pass filter on, which is over here. I really don't have any background noise going on. Um, this would be if somebody's quiet, the plus 20, you need to get more um, sound. And this is something a little bit louder, maybe in a concert, and um, there's more noise. So right now I have a zero. I'm just recording here. Um, and that's what it looks like. And this is what it looks like on the camera. Forgot to say one thing. The only thing that seems to get in the way is the uh, wire. Um, with this screen on this camera you can open it and flip it but because the uh, door over here is open it makes it a little hard to rotate and flip your screen if you need it um, it's kind of hard right now there you go so just a little bit harder to do but there you go if you got it set right you can do it other ways it sometimes just gets in the in the way but right now it um it works just something to keep in mind if you need to use it see i can't rotate it all the way up it hits back um here because your door is open see so you can't rotate your screen as well as you'd want um so you can only go that far and that's that much anyways i'll give you some more tests So when I think about marriage, I think about change. Change because marriage is defined by time. And we all change over time. The question is, do we change together then, or do we grow apart? To celebrate and rejoice with, at the good pleasures, joy, love, and light of this life. Kellen, you have a true heart of gold. So tender and kind. So joyous and lighthearted. You are amazing in all that you do, and that includes loving me. Thank you for the forgiveness, love, Compassion, passion, sense of, sense of wonder and adventure you bring to our relationship. All right, I'm recording with the Rode mic, and this is set at zero. Um, and it's just on the regular on position. It's not on the high pass frequency. Um, there was a car that just went by uh, behind us, so I'm not sure if it's gonna pick it up or not. And uh, my dog's walking around right here, so I don't know if you could hear, hear his footsteps. I'm talking at a minimal level, I'm not yelling, I'm not screaming, this would probably be a, a perfect interview um, setting right here. I also have the camera on, um, autofocus so um, I want to see if the camera will pick up on the um, the focus sounds so this is test one let's go to test two let's do uh, plus 20 hi so this is plus 20 this is the camera setting you'd use or the road mic setting you'd use for an interview or if someone was talking quiet um, this is a good single conversation uh, mode and uh, I'm gonna try to whisper so let's see how much it could pick up if someone was talking really quiet 
um, I still have the autofocus on the camera because I'm really curious on um, the sound it's going to pick up from the the lens focusing. Uh, typically, I would never film like that. I would always do my manual um, focus. There's some birds flying around and I'm talking really loud now. So this is my other test. Again, we're on the plus 20 on the back of the road mic. There's a switch you switch to the plus 20 and I am doing that. Next, we're going to go over to the negative 10, which you would use on um, probably a concert setting. So let's go try that now. So now we are in the uh, negative 10. Uh, that's the setting you'd want to use if you're recording live music. Um, if you're in a concert hall, maybe um, you have some friends coming over and you're just jamming, playing some banjos, having a good time with a squeeze box, uh, or a big concert hall and you're recording the whole concert. This would be a good setting for that. Uh, still I'm talking, I don't have a banjo to play you or um, symphony, so we're just testing it out. And now I'm going to switch over to the high frequency um, pass. Um, it's the switch that goes off, on, and then it goes to high frequency. So I'm going to turn that on and see what we got. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. Alright, so I'm on the... That's enough. That's I'm on my zero setting. And uh, I'm not on the negative 10, I'm not on the plus 20, I'm right in the middle, and I switched it over to high frequency, which is supposed to take away annoying background noises like my son playing video games right now, um, or an airplane or traffic going by. I had a neighbor, and that's behind the camera. I had a neighbor doing some yard work, so it would have been perfect for that. I'm talking normal. Okay, that's enough! And here is me whispering. That's enough. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so this is the high frequency. Of course, it's really quiet here. I can't hear a thing. Um, you'd use this mode, I guess, if there's a lot of background noise that you wanted to um, get rid of. So I don't know if you'd use this very much, but I bet it would come in very handy. So this is my test with my screaming child in the background, and I hope you enjoyed it. And so far, seems really good. Talk to you soon. Bye.